so I spent the day at the movies uh, uh, seeing a double feature of comedies, um, in fact, buddy comedies. Uh, the first one was Harold and Kumar, who is back for a third um, movie as part of their franchise, this one revolving around the Christmas holiday. And the second movie that I watched is uh, Tower Heist with uh, Ben Stiller and Eddie Murphy. So, um... Having seen these two movies back to back and both being comedies, hopefully this should be very easy for me to uh, review. So I, hopefully I won't get them too confused from one or the other. Uh, Harold and Kumar, funny movie, obviously. Uh, I like this type of humor. It's just a fun movie to watch. And um, if you like the characters in the other two previous movies, I mean, obviously they don't need to really fix anything that's broken. Uh, they keep the humor and the concept and everything pretty much the same, so I mean they give you what you're used to and don't really change anything that much. Which I don't know if it's a good thing, but for me I, I enjoy knowing what I'm getting myself into when it comes to those movies. Uh, it's a movie that obviously you can't really predict because they do some of the most craziest things in those films, so you have absolutely no idea what's coming. But um, overall, I thought it was pretty good. Um, acting was pretty par. Um, Danny Trujillo is in it, and he comes off as very tough and brooding. Sometimes he'll play a horror movie here and there, but I love when he does comedy. And in this one, I, even though he had somewhat of a small role, I thought that the parts in his, uh, the parts in this movie with him in it were were pretty good. Uh, the writing was a little cheesy, of course. Um, nothing too creative, but um, I thought it was a very fun script and. Of course, uh, Neil Patrick Harris came back and reprised his role, and of course, his bit was amazing. Uh, do I recommend this movie? No. I don't think this needs to be seen in theaters. Um, I think the only way you can see this movie is in 3D. That's the whole sort of concept they're going with this. And it really wasn't worth the 3D, so um, if you can wait until it goes on Blu-ray or DVD, I would wait for that. Uh, as far as replay value, I think that this movie um, can definitely be watched again. Um, it, again, it's just a fun movie to watch. So, um, overall, I'll give that movie a 3 out of 5. Now, for Tower Heist, uh, I also had a little laughs in this one, too. Not as much as Harold and Kumar. Uh, this movie took a more serious route, um, especially in the beginning of the film. So, um, the first part of it was a little slow. Um, it didn't really start getting good until Eddie Murphy entered into the picture and I'm glad to see him out of the kid films and actually doing some comedy where he shines the best. Uh, the writing, uh, it was a good concept but I think the flow of the movie was a little slow and a little off pace. It was definitely predictable to watch. I mean we knew kind of what was going to happen throughout the entire film. Uh, do I recommend this movie? Uh, I am going to say no. And I'll say it because, again, theater costs. There's really no reason for you to pay for this m movie to be in theaters. And um, it wasn't as good as I thought it was going to be. I thought it was going to be a lot more funny. I mean, the director, Brett Ratner, uh, who did the Rush Hour movies, I thought that those movies were well done and very funny. And I thought that I was going to expect that same sort of dynamic from these two. Uh, ben Stiller and Eddie Murphy, but I didn't get it. And so, uh, do I do I think that this movie can be uh, watched over again? After you watch this, I mean, it's good, but it's not something that I would never, you know, choose to watch again um, in the near future. So I wouldn't say it has replay value either. So overall, I give this movie two out of five. And, um, again, I had a great time seeing both of them, um, but I think Harold and Kumar sort of shined a little bit better than Tower Heist. So, those are my reviews, and hope you enjoyed them.